Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is Dragonfly Gamer UK, and we are back in Station Ears and ready to continue building our space rocket. Um, I have a few. F Oop, nope, don't throw them away. I have a few fuel tanks on me, which I think I need to go and place in my rocket so I can start running some plumbing in. Have I got some pipes on me? I do have pipes on me, that's a good thing. So obviously you need a fuel tank to be able to store fuel on your ship. Um, I may have to move you. Um, let's just quickly... you can go there, go to that. You can go in there for now. So obviously we've got power there and we've got two fuel lines here and here. Um, Oh, how many fuel tanks do I need? Um, I need more rocket fuel tank kits. Okay, so I've got two there, and that isn't enough, it would seem. Right, let's go and see how many we need. I think we've got another one somewhere. Did I put one in here? Hunger, caution. No, I didn't, so I need to go and print more fuel tanks. doesn't actually say how many I need, does it? Okay. You know what, while I'm here, I don't really need this on me. And I don't need them on me. That'll do. So, what do we need to build more fuel tanks? I think it's steel. Yep, steel and copper, we've got plenty of both, so let's build another couple of those. Maybe three or five, I can't remember if I'm honest. Um, tell you what, let's uh, get fuel tank kit. What does it say it needs? Five kits, okay, so we need five. Two there, how much have I got here? That's three, that's enough for one. I want a couple of tanks, so... Yeah, I should have enough for another... Five, do you think? Twenty-five copper, yeah, and fifty steel. Yeah, easy. And I've got cabling, now I need some heavy cabling. Five, so that's enough to make one tank. I need another three. No, oh, no. Let me get out of here. If I can. There's been a build up of gas in my base. And it's ignited. That's annoying. I've got to hope it doesn't do too much damage. Okay, it's dying off. Okay, now we're okay. Alright, I can stop that now. I think that's the three I needed. Yeah, when you seal a base up like this, you can get a build-up of gas. And sometimes it'll ignite. Which is what happened there. You just gotta try and get out of there so you don't get caught in the blast. Right. Fuel tanks. Actually, while we're here, can we do a... Rocket battery? Yeah. Set that going. Oops, there's a door. <laughs> Let's pick up our other two tanks and the pipes. Right, try again. Ah, it's more like it, so how high can I go? Do I have another fuselage? So if I come down a bit and look up, you can see there is a pipe in and a network in. They will both need to be connected. So the pipe obviously is on this corner. 
So I want to close to here. Oh. Like so. And I don't think I'll fit the other tank in the same part of the fuselage. I'll have to build it on top. However, I can now. Run some piping in. No, oh, you spanner. Like so. And I need to get the station connect the fuel connection. So I can do that. Put that in, and I need a power connection, so I can run that in. So there's network connection on here, which I need to plug all this in together, along with the avionics and everything. Right, let's go get another fuselage and station battery. Can you close? I didn't do another fuselage in here, did I? No, it's access bridge. Umbilical, umbilical, umbilical. No, I didn't. Like a happy face over there. <laughs> Just the two lights. Uh, what we've got in here. I think you can probably just vent you looking at the temperature. Um, battery. Battery medium, auxiliary battery. Two rocket battery kits, uh, ten cable coils, four electronic parts. Um, okay, set that go. That's just... I don't know why I'm getting such a build up of gas in here. Where's it coming from? Where is that gas coming from? Fuselage, get another one of them. Yeah, there's no build up, there's no volatiles in here or anything. It's a 94, 95% CO2. Strange. Unless Amy's been dumping volatiles on the floor. we doing with the cabling? Eight. That's not going to be enough. What do we need for more cabling? Copper. Okay, let's go smelt some more copper. Do this. There we go. Gas in, ignite. Copper into you. Set you going again. How are we doing with this fuselage? Ninety-three. Come on, hurry up. So data link. It's one of the 
things I'm going to need. Okay. Um, kit from small mass, small rocket, gonna need that. Hydration critical. Okay, which we got there. Let's just stop that for now. Gonna sort out my hydration and a feeding and everything else. To be fair, it's been a while since I've had to come and eat and drink. Ah, jetpack's doing okay, it's got 8,000. Um, my oxygen skills got 2,000. Up to 175. Let's just do it while we're here. Just be on the safe side. Um, what's left to do? Okay, so let's just stick that in there. Shower. How are we doing on you? Three litres. Can't be out of power. No, we're not. So why aren't you turned on? That's odd. Okay. Let's just get all my stuff back on. We'll sort out what's wrong with that. Why haven't you got power? Have you got power? No. Oh, well, I'll tell you why. But you're down, aren't you? Yeah, see. I was, remember last uh, one of the previous episodes I said about these being reset. Oh, what's that done to my food? Alright, so I'm turning on them off. Don't need that on. You're back on. You're going. That's okay. Right. <clears throat> yep, close the helmet. There's our ship battery. I love how far he can jump when you jump up them stairs. Alright. Fuselage. Let's go for another A2. Tanks. Um, I need to move the tank over a bit so I can get both the data and power through. Do that. My spanner. There it is. That's that's pumped into that tank, that's pumped into that tank. We have cables. Coming 
down here. Oops. Um, let me think about this. Where's that b b b b b b battery? Yeah, it's just trying to make sure you can fit everything inside the ship, you see, it can be a bit challenging. Battery in, power in, power out. Five cable, oh, I've only got three cable coils. Okay. Come on, you know, let us turn like that. Are they in line? Yep. And then you to go there, okay. So that's all on the output side of that. I need the transformer on this side, I believe. Good. So I need the data port to be not facing out. That should do it. I could probably do it higher than that, I must. Oh no, I can't. That's the size I can do it. Is that there? That's enough room to bring a cable around there. And you there. Oh, the data port's still on the outside. What a fool. That's it. Right. Data port. I can't remember if that needs to tie into um, which side the battery that needs to tie into. But it's this side or the other side. For now, let's just. tie into this side. Um, I need this to come through to a connection on the. I realise what I've just done. Sorry guys, I'm going to have to take this out. I'm going to have to move all this. Alright, you can go there. Yeah, I'm going to have to move this, I think. Bring my data... my battery power in higher. I can go there. Screwdriver. Take you up, back out again. You can go there. Take you. All right, I need two batteries. Let's start over over this side. So power in and data. No, that won't fit there. Oh, for God's sake, behave. Right, power into there. Data up to there. Now battery. I need a double-sized battery. I need a medium battery.
was the data or not on that side. So I can put you there. this round to tie into that because that's the output of the battery. If I can see what I'm doing. Like so, so. Power in. Power out. Okay, I'll do for now. Where did I put the rocket data link? <clears throat> so this is pretty much like a computer that the the, the link for your um, rocket. Ah, I can't put it up there, can I? Darn it. Okay, I could put it here and it's not too in the way and it's easy to link in. Let's do that. That's that. Get some more bit. What else do I need for that? Screwdriver and two cable cords. I can do that one at least. Heavy cable cars. I can't do that one. Oh. <laughs> I should check what I need for these before I do know that. I'm also going to need another fuselage as well. At least one more fuselage, probably two. And there's a storm coming. Where's Amy? Come back, Amy. Okay, you're back. Let's shut that door. Okay, and uh, she switched off. Um. Right. Stairwell, kit, rocket scanner. I will need that at some point. Rocket mine, I will need that. Rocket liquid fuel tank. I've got only that. I've got that. Date link we've got. Circuit housing. I need that. Got the avionics. Celestial Tracker That um, Cargo Storage Oh, I need in bar Osploy, no no, no, no. So I need to make some invar to do that one. Close that. Okay, let's hold off on that one then. Battery we've got. Pumped liquid engine, uh, gas engine we've got. A pressure fed gas engine we've got. We've got the umbilical. I need two of those, one on either side. Ooh, let's try. I can't remember if I need an umbilical for the boat, uh, the ship, for the rocket, and an umbilical for the um the tower. Let's go and have a look. I know I've got another umbilical in my control room. I didn't make any heavy cable cars, did I?
Right, let's just have a quick look. Want to storm sort, I'm gonna have to drop like a stone or so, otherwise I'll air. Uh... Yeah, that's what I need. Right. I'm going here. I'm gonna try and find a space for this to go. That's power in like so. Right, and I need to connect that up, but now I can. Come on. There we go. That one. And is it that way? No, nope, it's not. I just put that in the wrong way. So I need power in on this side. Let me do it from the other side and I'll show you what happens when I get in the right height. So that's our power for the ship there. Is that in line with it? There it is. And the connection's moved across to line up with that. So that, once I connect it up, I can then extend the umbilical and start powering the ship. I need to do the same with the gas. Uh, with the pipe. Let's, I've got the pipe on me. On me. Oh, damn it. Okay, I won't show you with the, uh, the pipe, because um, the storm's coming along. Don't need that on me at the moment, don't need that on me at the moment. So I need another shoot umbilical and another gas umbilical. Gas umbilical, there's that one. And the shoot umbilical, where's that? Shoot umbilical. Shoot umbilical that allows the power to get power into the rocket. Um, I then need a iron. What the various things I can do with this durable drilling head, iron and steel, uh, ice mineral. Long term, what does that one take? Invar. Let's just look at the high speed mineral for the time being. Oh, that needs invar. That needs invar. You need iron. Let's get rid of most of that gas. Still 3 megapascals, still 4 megapascals. It's okay. So these are all the things you need, you see, to, to connect in, yeah, get inside your ship, which is why I need three or four fuselages and a, um, a nose cone. But I need some cabling, heavy cabling, to get you going again. It's slow. Okay, take you. Uh, gas feed. Have I got the storage? I can't remember if I got the storage or not. I don't think I did. Cargo storage. No, I didn't because I needed Invar, didn't I? What do I need for Invar? Invar is nickel and iron. You can hear that going woo 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 outside. I don't know if you can see that like spinning there or not. Generating 10 kilowatts. Uh, yeah, gen generates loads of power. Okay, so this. Turn that off. So it is 1227 degrees C. Here we go. Got it. Right. 
and you can go in there and I'll print you stop that for the moment so I've got the scanner Umbilical, umbilical. It's storm passed. Yes, it has. Yeah, it's going to do a bit more on the rocket. I need some, 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 some. Electronic parts. I need four of these, and I'm good enough for four. I'm going to run out of iron. How many is in there? Three, four. Right, let's go through some bits on the rocket. Some more bits on the rocket. So that's the electronics, uh, the electrical input. Um, shoot umbilical. No, I don't want to shoot umbilical. I want the gas umbilical. Like so. And I want you. Let's list your tracker. You can go together. Circuit housing. Put you there. Wrong way around. Oh, I don't know what I saw this, have I? M, 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 M. You can put you up there. I can put you there. You there. That way. That's it. That's lined up now. That's right. Cabling. there I'm just going to bring it down just so I can get to those switches here so if I press this it should extend the umbilical and it has and the same with that one press turn it on press that and it won't because it's got no gas connection. Okay, so we can fix that. Oh, we can when I get some more gas pipes. See about four or five more gas pipes there. That is lined up with that, isn't it? Yes, it is. Yeah. Um, you need. Cable coils and a screwdriver. Oh, it's normal cable coils. Why do I think it was heavy cable coils? Normal cable coils, then. Okay, haven't got those. As you can see, it can get very tricky trying to get everything inside this uh, ship, inside the rocket. You do sort of struggle trying to stack everything right so you can connect everything into it. Go then, what do you need? 
electronic parts at right hand and that's it so that's our battery now connected so no one button on that battery oh crap the data port's there isn't it why not put the data port on that side that was a stupid thing to do hand drill wire cutters hand drill I think right it's a big battery that's how I wanted it like that. Now, cable, screwdriver, electronics parts. That's better. So there's the on switch, there's the data cable, that's what's after. Data connection. So, there's a power input, it's there, I've got to try and run that up to the bottom of my battery, you know what, it's going to be easier to move this, looking at that it's going to be a lot easier just to move this, let's take you out there, Can I get that around there? Two and a half kilowatts, no, let's make it three kilowatts. Turn you on, I know there's no power coming in at the minute. Take you out. Oh, didn't want to drop that. That's fine, that's moved over. Cable cutters. Going up. You should be charging. Right, what have I got left to do to you? Screwdriver, cable coils, heavy cable coils. This is where I need the heavy cable coils. Uh, electronic parts in the right hand. How many? Um, Q 
see if we can find the rocket uplink. Is it uplink? Logic uplink. We need two cable coils, have two electronics parts, two steel sheets. So I need two electronics parts. That thing I'm building at the moment is almost like the this bit here for Amy. This is what communicates with Amy. That bit I'm building is what communicates with the rocket. Um, you two electronics parts. that. Oops. A bit twitchy with the mouse. And then the welder and some steel. Boom. Come on, stop being silly. There we go. So you're connected to there, you're connected to there, you're connected to, to you. No no rockets connected, that's because I've not put the um, avionics in the rocket yet. Okay, so we've done a bit more on the rocket there, guys. Um, we've got a couple of umbilicals in. Oh, we're taking out. I thought it was straight in there, wasn't it done? There we go. Uh, we put a couple of umbilicals in, um, so we've got the gas going in, want to get some pipe work. Want to get some more pipes, I'll bring a pipe down to there to connect, and then I'll need to bring the pipe up here. Actually, let's just for now cheat a little bit and rob that just so I can. just take it straight across, couldn't I? Don't think it's slight of a difference. That's now plumbed into there. You will fly. Oh, you will turn on. Click you. You will extend. Yeah, so that's extended. That's extended. When the pipe's in, it'll start fueling these tanks. I need another fuselage section or two, because I need to start putting the drilling heads and the storage. So there's the storage. Um, the scanner. That needs to go in here. This gets attached to the storage unit once I've built it. And then um, obviously I've got the um, storage output to connect to the umbilicals with chutes. Uh, so the avionics unit's got to go in. Um, what was the other part? This one. Where can I get that? Can I get that there? I need to put a chip in there. So hold on. Let me move that. Turn like so. Just let me so I can get to the buttons. Going into there, it's going to there, to there, it's all connected up, that's connected up, that's connected up to there. That's a power input side, that's a power output side. Hmm, hmm. I need to change that. 
Sorry, if I do what I'm thinking there. That's data, I need the data on that side. No, I can't have that like that. Okay, I need to have a mess around with this. I need to move the battery, I think, above here. Then, because I need the battery feed going in, and then the outside, put side the battery and everything connected to the data side of things. So, I'll have a play around offline, guys, and I'll come back. Um, but yeah, we're getting there. Um, slowly getting there with everything. Will you turn on? I didn't turn you on either, did I? But I think I'll leave for now, guys. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Please hit like and subscribe. If you'd like to support me, I do have a Patreon page. Uh, if you've got any comments, please um, leave them in. Uh, please leave them below. And I'll catch you next time. Strong fire game. I wish you good night.